Hi everybody, so I'm prepping my turkey for an early Thanksgiving. So I've already done the butter compound, got the butter under the skin and on the skin of the turkey, um, which I'll be showing you momentarily. But now I'm gonna work my stuffing. So I'm not gonna lie, I always start it off with some stove top just to give me the base for the bed, breadcrumbs. I mean, you can't go wrong as a starting base when you don't have time to do your own breadcrumbs. Um, so in there I have four boxes of stove top. I'm gonna add some salt, some pepper. I'm going to throw in some of our seasoning salt that's new from Pampered Chef. It's one of those spices you can put with everything. My three onion rub because it's my favorite. Then I'm going to add some zest of a lemon. Just to give it some freshness. Keep the little lemon seed out of there. We are going to put in a little squirt of lemon juice. Then the other things that you put in it are optional, but I like to put apple. So we have a few apples that are past their prime days. So we're gonna use the apple wedger. Take some of the wedges. I'm gonna give them a rough chop. You can put celery or you can put, um, I guess it's cranberries or celery, which I was going to put in, but I thought I had some that I don't. So it's just going to be onions and apples being added to mine today. I'm just going to get that a toss. So my stuffing, I always stuff the bird, and then I also cook some outside of the bird because in my family we have different preferences. So I usually do it two ways. I'm gonna do another small apple. Again, with the apple wedger. Apple wedger is great for doing up apples for kids' lunches or snacks on the go. Great teacher gift. I'm just going to get the seeds out of the way. The apples are rough chop. is somewhat close in size. And then I'm just going to chop an onion as well. Okay, so for the onion, I'm just going to cut the one end off, the other end off, and now we have a new citrus and onion peeler set. So I'm going to use the white one, which I've deemed for onions, and you can peel your onion with this, just like you were peeling an orange. It allows you to get in under the skin. You can use the other end to get in there. Once you've scored it, it makes peeling an onion a little bit easier.
And I'm just going to cut the onion into pieces similar to the apple. I am going to keep a quarter of it to put in the neck of my turkey. So we're just going to keep that and put it aside. I'm going to give that a toss. When I come back, I will be adding the liquid to the stuffing and showing you how I insert it into the turkey because I use the measure all cup to do so. So we'll be back in a minute.